What is going on, or Jays Mafia guys? How are the people doing? Listen, everybody, in today's video, I'm going to be dropping a very unique idea, all right? A very unique video, a video idea that has never been done on MMA YouTube before. This is going to be an absolute banger today. I'm going to be talking about the UFC clones, all right? Now, as you can see, we have a bunch of fighters on the screen, but what if I were to tell you that each and every single one of these fighters has a lookalike, a UFC clone Two of the same person, basically, guys. We have nine different pairs of clones in this video that I want to be talking about. It's going to be insane. Yeah, man, I I've never seen so many lookalikes, and especially in this video, I'm going to get it down to the bottom of the barrel, guys, as always. There's no time to fucking waste. Let's get straight into it. So, I want to show you a couple lookalikes for with UFC fighters and, you know, maybe someone that looks like them outside of the UFC. So, let's get straight into it. I'm going to show you the first couple ones. We have Raphael Fazeev chilling with our boy Ragnar Lothbrok, a Viking. I mean, these two look extremely similar. I think both these dudes are Vikings. And I think this is a, a pretty sick fucking clone. But... The next one that I also want to talk about, guys, is Alexander Gustafsson with this guy. I really don't know who this guy is. If someone can elaborate to me who Alexander Gustafsson looks like, I'm not too sure who this guy is. But we're going to move on to my boy, Dustin Stoltzfus. Now, I know that, you know, not, a, not many people know my guy, Dustin Stoltzfus, but he's a UFC middleweight, and he looks exactly like Tom Hardy with a beard. I mean, this shit look kind of crazy, right? I mean, we've already gone over three clones, and half these dudes look the same. It, it's... it's it's honestly freaking me out, but the next one, guys, that I do want to talk about is Kevin Holland and Kevin Hart, all right? I mean, both these guys look exactly the same. They're both comedians. They're both pretty funny. They both got the drip. They both got the fades. I mean, they both look exactly like each other. I mean, Kevin Holland's like the comedian of the UFC. Kevin Hart is a legend. We all know this, but guys... Bruh. Bruh. Oh my god! Wow! Those were just a couple UFC clones that I had to discuss before we actually get into the proper, the legit ones, alright? So let's not waste any time. We're going to talk about my boy, Kyle Nelson, right now. Look at Kyle Nelson on the screen. This guy's bald. I have to describe the physical features you get, man. I have to describe the bald head, the beard, you know what I'm saying? And I think this guy looks exactly like Garam Kuta de Ledze, man. I think these two look exactly the same. I think they're basically pretty identical. Yeah, I mean, how can you not say that they literally look exactly the fucking same, dude? They have a beard, bald head, chest on their fucking, or hair on their chest, pardon me. I can't even speak a sentence today, but dude... If these two were to fight, I have no clue who's fighting who. So that was the first pair that I wanted to talk about, guys. I mean, dude, they look exactly the same. But we're going to move on to an even crazier lookalike with our boy Kelvin Gastelum right now. Look at Kelvin Gastelum, the Chicano. He has black hair, black eyebrows, a black beard. You know what I'm saying? He got that fridge, that belly fridge. But... I will say that Kelvin Gastelum looks exactly like Nazrat Hakpras. Now, Nazrat Hakpras is a UFC lightweight. He's from Afghanistan. I mean, he's got the black hair. He's got the fucking black beard. I mean, these, these, both these guys have the Chicano look. You know what I'm saying? They look serious. Dude, they're basically long-lost cousins, and you can't tell me otherwise. I think these two look exactly the same. These two basically fight like each other as well with the boxing, and I think it's just fucking funny as hell, man. This is one of the best UFC lookalikes, but let me know what you guys think. We move on. Onto the next clone, and we're talking about my boy Alice Caceres right now. Bruce Leroy, the man's an OG, the man's a legend, in my opinion. And I think this guy has a clone, and his clone is Peyton Talbot. All right, now I know a lot of people aren't the biggest fan of Peyton Talbot, he's got this, you know, <laughs> black hole in his chest. But both these dudes have the curly hair. A lot of people are referencing both these guys to, you know, have similar looks and. I think these guys do look the same, and I feel like both these guys fight the same as well. You know, obviously throwing a lot of kicks. I think Peyton Talbot's probably better than Caceres, but these are both fucking Gs, man. They both look the same. They both got the broccoli hair. Respect to both of them. And the last clone pair that I wanted to talk about, guys, was Anthony Smith. All right, now look at my boy Anthony Smith. You know, he's got the nice bald head. He's a pig. We all know that Anthony Smith is half pig, half human. You can't tell me otherwise. And I think Anthony Smith's clone is Bogdan Guzgov. Now, Bogdan Guzgov, look at this guy, man. You know, he's got the fucking bald head. Both these guys got Giga Chad bald heads. I mean, 
Dude, they look exactly the same. How can you not tell me they don't? I mean, they both look like half pig, half human. I mean, we can see a photo right here of them together. They're having fun. They're chilling. I feel like these guys are brothers, man. Like grown up brothers that are bald. They're just chilling. You know what I'm saying? But guys, those were all of the UFC lookalikes, all right? Now, I had to make this video. I knew that there were a bunch of clones that needed to be discussed, all right? This video needed to be made on MMA YouTube. There's so many fucking lookalikes in the UFC, and I feel like I covered each and every single one of them. But guys, as always, I want to say thank you so much for watching the video. If you made it to the end, don't forget to go ahead and smash the boy a like button. Subscribe to the channel if you're new. Comment down for the algorithm. What do you think of this video? And like I said, man, this was an important video bro i had to get this off my chest i knew that there were a bunch of clones in the ufc and i couldn't let them get off the hook no more i had to expose these fools but as always guys thank you so much for watching and i will be dropping some bangers in the future so until then take care